Hey Airsoft Gunsmiths, today we're talking about the Barrett REC7 gas block and outer barrel. It's a gas piston system that'll give you a great look for your AEG. Now it comes in two sizes, it comes with a longer version, carbine length, and it comes with a CQB version. So it's good for pretty much anyone that, want th that wants this look. Now before we get started, the, one of the things that you're going to want to do is you're, wanna, you're going to want to remove your rail system and your outer barrel, inner barrel, and barrel nut. It's very important that you remove your barrel nut because we're going to need that again later. To install this REC7 gas block on your rifle, it's extremely simple like i said earlier you're going to go ahead and remove your outer barrel inner barrel and your barrel nuts and to install this all you're going to do is you're going to remove this like so so you have the gas piston then you're simply going to take a hex screw and this port right here there's a hex head screw inside of there take your tool Slowly loosen it, making sure you've loosened it. You don't need to completely take it out because what that ends up doing is just doing something nice and easy like that. Then you want to go ahead and take your barrel nuts that you've already previously taken out from your AEG. Slide that over top like right there. Go ahead and place this back. Retighten this down. Then go ahead and reinstall your rod. Then once everything is back installed, go ahead and slide your outer barrel into your upper receiver and the barrel nut over. And you can go ahead and tighten this back down. Go ahead and use your tool to tighten it depends on the type of barrel nut that you have which will fit and what tool works for it now the rail we're using is the omega x 7 inch which splits in half now if you have a free float rail system what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take these two pins located right here you're going to want to take a punch or something similar and go ahead and knock these out and then you're gonna wanna take a rubber mallet or if you only have a steel ball peen hammer, uh, I recommend putting some tape or something soft on the end because what you're gonna wanna do is tap this gas block out of the way. Once the gas block is tapped out, all you're gonna have to do is take your free float rail system, go ahead and put it over top of it and then go ahead and reinstall the gas block and you'll notice that there's two grooves located that are cut out for these pins to sit in go ahead and reinstall the pins i'd recommend using a punch or something similar to go ahead and make sure that they're tapped in and completely sit flush after that it's all set and good to go and that there you have it it's the rsc7 gas block and outer barrel is all set up all you're going to do is throw your rail over top of it so there you have it, it's installed, it's good to go. It's available at your retail stores right now. Go ahead and pick it up.